pleading to be released from prison. Today we heard from Shonda James, who's been locked away for more than 25 years after killing her aunt and kidnapping her cousin in Giles County. Stephanie Langston was there for James's parole hearing. One board member recommended denying parole. It's a story you'll only see here on News 2. Well, despite the recommendation, Shonda James was all smiles following today's hearing, reassuring supporters that she will not give up in her fight for parole. I'm okay. I know, but it's okay. I'm okay. Nearly two dozen supporters came to back Shonda James, who was sentenced to life with parole 27 years ago. I made the choice to shoot and kill my Aunt Kelly in our house in Giles County, and today I'm asking you to, to choose to grant me parole. In 2011, Governor Phil Bredesen commuted James' sentence for the crime she committed when she was 14, making her immediately eligible. I want to have an answer to make all of the all of this be better or make sense, but I don't have an answer. While in prison, James has earned her GED and certification as a peer recovery specialist. She says she wants to mentor others outside of the prison walls. All I can do is pay my healing forward because there is nothing Nothing, I, nothing I can do to give it back, to bring Kelly back. Family members gripped photos of the victim, their Aunt Kelly, while fighting tears. She's not better. She's just manipulating. That's what she's good at. Following the hearing, supporters vowed that James isn't done yet, blowing her kisses and sharing affectionate words. I love you. Some saying they will keep praying she is released. Come home. I'm, I'm attempting to. Now, today's board members saying this is a difficult case, pointing to her young age when she committed the crimes and her family trauma. However, he says that does not mitigate the significance of these crimes. Reporting from West Nashville, Stephanie Langston, News 2. Now, this was James's third parole hearing. There have to be four concurring votes for a final decision, which could take weeks. Her parole case would be reviewed again in three years.